Hi everyone, I wanted to introduce myself. My name is Molly Sharfman and I want to welcome you to our course, Experiential Education Strategies for the Classroom. I'm very much looking forward to learning with all of you over these next four weeks. And I wanted to preface by saying that many of us have been doing experiential education for many years and not even realizing it because it didn't have a name. And I feel very blessed to be living in a time when experiential education is its own field of research and there are people who have devoted their lives to studying how we can make Jewish education effective through experiential means. We will not be only be reading, but we will together try to figure out how to implement these techniques into our respective classrooms and talk about what our goals are at the end of the day. Um, I have been listening to the needs of Jewish Jewish youth for many years now, whether they are from rural Frederick, Maryland, to New York, to smaller U.S. communities, um, or, you know, or Jews from the former Soviet Union who are scattered across Germany. I've worked with my, uh, all those communities. And I will also speak from my graduate school experience at the Davidson School of Jewish Education at the Jewish Theological Seminary, where I recently graduated with a degree in Jewish education, concentrating in experiential learning, and I'm really excited to open up this conversation. We're going to jump right in to what is experiential education, what does it mean to you, working definitions, but I want to give a little background about me and my Jewish experiential journey. It's very hard to say when it began for me. Um, I really took the cue from my parents who were heavily involved in the Baltimore Jewish community where I grew up. I started at an early age, volunteering at various organizations, Jewish organizations, um, teaching at a local Hebrew school, raising money for Israel, educating um, my, my fellow peers. Um, and I have to say that Jewish experiential education is the reason why I'm teaching this course today, why I'm so passionate about Jewish education. Um, and, you know, whether it was the Shabbaton retreats that my day school took us on, the youth group I was heavily involved in, my various trips to Israel, I'm a product of all of them. But if I did real soul searching, I would have to say that my journey, experiential learning about Judaism began with my grandfather, my Zaidi, who was a Chazan, and I learned everything I knew from him. He was a survivor, a Holocaust survivor, but he was one of the most happiest people that I knew, and he loved Judaism more than anyone that I knew. And I would sit with him, I would run and sit with him when he would come to visit from New York. He would tell me stories about his family and the world that was in Hungary, where he grew up. And I would sit with him when he prayed, and he would sing to me all the prayers, all this philo. And he empowered me to ask questions about Judaism, about faith. And I want to compare this relationship that I had with my grandfather to the Pesach Seder, because that was the culmination every year of our relationship. Now, what do we have at a Pesach Seder? To me, that is the most ideal experiential setting um, because what do we have there? We have an incredible story to tell. We have all the family around. We have this meeting, cosmic meeting of generations, older and younger. That doesn't happen so often anymore because people are scattered so far away from each other. And the older generation imparts the younger generation the story and the values of our, of our of Judaism and our Jewish community and family values. And what we want for our youth is that we want them to ask questions through the Manish Tana model, but ultimately we want them to come back for more, that it doesn't end at the Manish Tana. And that is what happened with me through my grandfather and my Pesach Seder and all the different experiential programs that I did in my education, that I came back for more. And I chose to be part of, you know, the story of the Jewish story and imparting values to the next generation. So I am very excited again to be working with all of you about, you know, on a topic that I'm very passionate about and I'm sure everyone is passionate about as well um, in Jewish education and let's jump right in. Thank you.